a brand new quick play spell card, Monster Reborn. Make sure you guys smash the leave living crap out of that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out more awesome content. Reborn the monster with a spell card. Yes. So the art for this actually goes really, really hard. I, I, I actually love this. So this is actually, what is it, the manga panel from when he's fighting the a guy with the red dark magician, where you see both monster reborns reviving both of the dark magicians simultaneously. I would love for the opposite art panel for this to be another version of this, but this card is incredibly straightforward. So it's called Spell Card Monster Reborn. So it's quick play, you only actually have one card this card's name per turn. Guess what it does? <laughs> Target one monster in either graveyard. Special summon it to your field, but it cannot attack or activate its effects this turn. Now, I hate to be the bearer of bad news for you here, but we just got a quick play monster reborn. That's that's all this is. If you were expecting something exciting, something crazy, something amazing. No, it's cool that you're able to revive anything that you want at this point, but the problem right now is it's honestly just kind of subpar. You know, I also don't know what deck you're going to play this in. I also don't know what your interaction... Can we can we use the cards that have Monster Reborn in the name to interact with this? Is that possible? Or do these quotes that we have around the name actually ruin the feel for what you can do with this? I'm not exactly sure too much in the aesthetic department what they can do. I also want to point out here, at this point in time, I almost feel like we can unlimit Monster Reborn. Does any, anybody out here feel like bringing Monster Reborn to... To three feels bad or crazy. Yeah, you got some crazy Egyptian god support over here in the corner that you know you can toss monster borns at the wall. And but like, even if you revive an Egyptian god, that means you had to have seen the cards to drop the Egyptian god. You have to see the monster reborn. That technically means you could thrust into the dark or into the monster reborn to do things. But I don't know. At this point in time, I think this card is a very good example and a very good play test of hey. We can actually bring Monster Reborn back. We don't actually have a problem with this card. And, you know, we can kind of open up the doors. Or at least we can bring Monster Reborn back to two. Right? Like, I think two plus three of these. Once again, this is a quick play. Like, you know, you're not getting any crazy immediate value off of it. Because whatever you're bringing out is literally going to be blanked anyway. It's just a free body on the field for you to do whatever. But... I guess cool card, to say the least. So what do you guys think? Please leave a comment down below. Tell me what you guys think. I'll see your beautiful faces back here later in the day, guys. Peace. Patrons, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.